I had new arena missions. Yeah, I stopped last time uh, when we had uh, arena missions, and I was like, yeah, I'll just do them next time. So, I guess we're going to hit the arena in a minute. Check out those boosters that we got. Probably gills. They're pretty lightweight. They got a big uh, EN cost. You can quick boost a lot quicker with them, 0.3. Hmm. You get a lot more thrust. I want to try them out, but I have to figure a way to get them fitting. So let's... Good old songbirds, but you're going to have to go. I fucking swear, this this OG blade is legit so damn good. <laughs> it's tracking is amazing. It, um, what is it? It's got, where is it? Direct hit adjustment, 230. So when you get them stunned and you hit with this thing, it does like 200% more per swing. And most things don't have that high, melee wise. Uh, like even the, even the, uh, Pile bunker is only 150, but it, the pile bunker does so much damage to begin with. It doesn't need that high of a multiplier. It's just the pile bunker's uh, point blank is really hard to use. Uh, but there are, there are legs I think that have. I think it's legs. They have like a. Where is it? Not target tracking. I don't think it's target tracking, is it? Uh, target tracking performance during lock on. The higher the value, the more likely you are you to land shots on moving targets. That's not what I'm looking for. Uh, is it arms? Something has a melee boost. Uh, it, it's the. Shocker, it's the boosters. Uh, they have a melee boost uh, thing. So, you, melee uh, attack thrust. Um, thrust when homing in on enemies with melee weapons. So, th having a having a thingy with this high, like these ones have like super high boost. Uh, so, you go really far with your melee tracking. And now I'm seeing this, this actually got a pretty low one. So that's kind of curious. What do these do better than everything else? Maximum tolerable AC weight before quick boost reload time is compromised. Reload time. Which is uh, how fa pretty much how fast you can do consecutive boosting. So that, that's not horrible. Because you, you really shouldn't need to be boosting like boom, 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 boom. But that's what this thing uh, seems to have like the best of. Um, this allows you to go fast with a lot of mini boost. It's melee thrust is not that great. AP or AB boost uh, is the assault boost. Higher values, uh, swifter rush attacks. Uh, lower consumption means you can go for longer on your boosts. So... It's got a pretty good assault boost thrust. Not as good as some of the other ones, so I don't know. These are... Jet duration. Uh, what does that mean? Higher values correspond to greater distance traveled. Interesting. So this... The best thing about this is how fast you can do another one. 
So it's 0.3, and its thrust is 18,000, 18, with the duration... Hmm. It seems like you get a lot of smaller boosts out of this one, um, but it's still using the same amount of juice. Uh, consumption is still 620, where everything else is kind of still hovering around that as well. This one is probably the more ideal one to use because it's um, a lower cost. It's only uh, 480. It got it's got pretty good assault boost and uh, a lot better melee. Its quick boost is pretty low though. Maybe I want to go back to these again. Everything's going to run into Ian Shorefall. What's our generator again? Oh, and we're going back to normal mission, so I want to put my medium range targeting back on. We're still using this one. Man, look at that. 3,000 uh, EN, but its recharge rate is 200 compared to the 2,000 I have right now. Jesus. Some of these things you're just not meant to be dodging a lot. This one might be an okay one to shift to. It's got 900 recharge. Uh, oh, this one's got 1,200. Uh, it's weight is a lot higher, which our, late, our weight's not really too much of a concern right now with what we got going. Uh, but it gives us a lot more EN to work around, so let's try it. We got our good boy there. Uh, do we want to put... With this new EN amount, we can put like a Curtis or something on there too for backup. I've been like really partial to like big missiles everywhere. No, just not gonna lie. <laughs> just the more missiles, the better. Use system recovery. Uh, we can go back to this helmet. All of these are gonna be overburdened. Except for the one we got on. Yeah. We would have to get some bigger legs. Got more stability there. That's kind of the main stat I'm looking at here is stability. These hefty boys. Uh, but the heavier we get, uh, the slower we're gonna be. Need more missiles, right? Parts by. Oh, did you get it? Have you seen like some of these new ones, like this thing? <laughs> like I can only imagine what this thing can fucking do. Uh, then there's like another new laser cannon. This is like a shotgun laser cannon. You can turn it sideways. When you charge it, it turns sideways and shoots uh, horizontally. But like some of the new ones are like ridiculous. This, this launches a shield. I'm, I'm not sure how good that's really going to be. Um, but yeah, I haven't like all these like unlocked on our last mission. This is another one of those missiles that I really kind of want to do. 
got multi lock and everything. It, it looks sick. Um, oh, we got double splits. Uh, we did get double of the uh, big miscals too. This game is so sick. I know, right? I I do like how just some of the weapons are just like, just add just add a second one. Like here's your norm here's your split missiles. Like oh that's cool. How about we add a second one? Why not? Uh, oh yeah, the stun needles. Uh, we use this on the ice worm. You get like a giant rail gun on your arm for you for that. That was a fun mission. Ooh, look at that ice. We still got some thrusters, but we haven't bought, but I haven't really seen any that I like super care for. Just the constant peppering one, which is still pretty cool. Um, what's its magazine size? Does it say 45? That might actually be one I want to like pick up. Uh, this is Rusty's handgun. It just, it's just cool. This handgun is cool. <laughs> but handguns are low ammo, which is sadly sad. Sadly sad, yes. Uh, another bazooka. What is this? The, oh, this is the other laser rifle. I believe it charges. Yeah, you can charge it. This one's got a long charge. Uh, this is the other laser or laser shoddy. I think this is just like a lightweight version of it. But it's got a really I love that little like jerk emotion that he does with it to like fire this one. Like even the regular shot is like him like throwing it forward. It's kind of it's kind of cool, but I, I haven't found like a, a build that I want to use for it yet. It is pretty lightweight, too. Um, it's low ammo, too. But it might be fun. Uh, let's get that guy, because we, we said we might want to use him. Let's get you for funsies. Uh, what arm do I want to put those missiles on? Um, I got enough to actually get them on both. So I'm just going to do that. Go back to assembly. Sweet, we can put them both on. I'm okay with this. All right. What's the downside to using this on? Then? What's its ideal range? A little lower. Got a lot more rounds though, and it's a constant peppering. Okay. And uh, oh, we can fit our our. Uh, our laser whip onto this setup. I've been really digging this laser whip. All right, so what do we got? We're using these, so firearm specs are pretty good. Ooh, overburden. Kind of liking this one. Um, our boost speed and everything is like marginal differences, but we're pretty much getting bonuses everywhere. So I might change this. I say that as I click yes, we are. Legs. I am surprised we can get a lightweight leg going. We really want. 
We're pretty light right now. Oh, those are those new legs that we just got. Um, they're better. Load limit, stability. Our AP is still, we're still like at 9,000 health. Jeez, we're kind of, we're low on HP. We'd have to put some more beefy legs to get the... To be able to do this a little better. the EN output spec of the generator and influenced by the EN load of the AC, with lighter assemblies recovering EN more quickly. So the lighter you are, the more you can recover faster. Noted. That's why lightweight mechs are like fucking like bouncing around everywhere. go with like these again I don't know why I'm fiddling around so much when we got uh Nile G2 Nile He is in denial He's in denial if he thinks he's going to win I say before I get my ass kicked Arena Combat Aptitude Evaluation Program, number seven. You have now reached rank A. Subject AC, deep down. Call sign, Gun 2 Nile. Commencing Ooh. evaluation. He's got missiles. I hope he likes my missiles. activating combat mode. Where are you at, homie? Shot me. these missiles target destroyed concluding evaluation like because well they're so straightforward you can shoot them at like point blank verified thank you for chips Arena Combat Aptitude Evaluation Program, number six. Oh, rank A. he's got that thing, the uh, the lance. Oh boy, the laser lancer. Subject AC. I don't recognize Open that pistol. Faith. Call sign V2 Snail. 
Oh, he's got the railgun too. Sheesh. Guys, back. Evaluation. His color scheme is a dom, though, for sure. <laughs> like from Gundam. Where you at, buddy? Edge of the map? Serious right there? so good target destroyed yeah this this gun is really complimenting the whip though because of its well range you can like kind of hover around a mid-range and then always like throw the whip out right away Chippies. for like a, such a lightweight weapon it, it hits hard and it's got like a low cooldown We got chart, 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 reuse, chart reuse, umber ox, ali ali oxen. Arena combat aptitude evaluation Ooh, program number five, rank A. Bazooka, bazooka. How many bazookas this guy got? Jesus. Subject AC, Umber Ox. Call sign, Chartreuse. Chartreuse. Commencing evaluation. Must be French for I'm going to lose. Main system, activating combat mode. I see you... Okay. I need, I need to not rush at him like straight out of the shot. Woo! He's, um, you can't go straight at him. <laughs> so he's gonna teach me. He's gonna teach me how to uh, dodge while I'm using assault boost. Main system. Like he's, this guy's got no mid game, I feel like. That's where I feel he's gonna get like cream, because he you can just dodge his shit, because he's got nothing constant.
Easy. Where are you going, buddy? Yeah, Package down there. Destroyed. Including evaluation. Well done. You got no mid game. Um, the the computer always like alerts you when like a big thing is going to shoot at you, but not the small stuff. So like any charge shot, any bazookas, it always goes beep beep when it's going to shoot at you. And when he's got just four weapons that just kind of trigger that constantly, you just kind of have to just wait for it. Like all right, pretty easy to deal with you mid range. And then all the missiles are going to constantly force him to dodge. He'll run out of juice, especially if he's floating like that. Then you can get easy melees. Uh, but but if he hits you once, <laughs> if he hits you once, you're going to get staggered. Uh, what do we got? Thumb Dolmayan. Ooh, he looks beefy. Let's go a rank. Arena Combat Aptitude Evaluation Program. Oh, Number he's got... four, rank A. He's got Final the normal. Evaluation. This guy's kind of like a normal guy. Subject AC, a streak. Call sign, Thumb Dolmayan. He's got Nalpalm and he's kind of trying like doing evaluation. status effects. He's got electric and uh, the Nalpalm. So he's got fire and Just electric. Activating combat mode. His goal is to just put shit everywhere on the floor and keep you moving. That's kind of what I expected. He's putting down status as everywhere. Hmm. And he's he's got a good melee, and he's he's pretty much doing what I'm doing, except he's got uh, statuses instead of rockets. And that fire is just kind of everywhere. Activating combat mode. either let's go in uh he shot me right when i go in yeah that fire hurts and he's kind of tanky main system activating combat mode Oh! AP at 
I missed two lasers. <laughs> Target destroyed. Otherwise, that would have been done a lot quicker. I anyway, I started blasting. Bah, bah. No, I don't see so good, so I missed. That was kind of right. That's a pretty fun fight. That was a very interesting one, I would say the least. Um, I don't... I didn't really see the electric issue. The fire one was the problem. Because I know he, he had the electric ones, I think, too. I could be wrong. Incoming call. Congratulations. You have surpassed rank A. You. It is a great honor to witness your ongoing evolution as a mercenary. All Mind exists for all mercenaries. What are you gonna give me? Nothing? Some more OS tuning? Uh, we got all the damage mitigation. Um, we can go effectiveness on the healing. Melee driving, melee damage, we can get the bonus. Then. Let's get the, let's, yeah, we're boosting our melee a little bit. Midge more. Uh, direct damage would go 10%. We're not really using explosives. I was using, uh, cause my build was more kinetic weapons. I think, so I was kind of thinking to go for those more. Do, 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 do. I mean, I'm sure eventually you'll get everything. Maybe. Hello there. Hello, Raiders. Oh my goodness. Sister Mortis. I don't know if I recognize you. Hello. How you guys doing? Hello, Raid. Hello? Like, hello or hello? That's cute. I like it. You should know me. Is that like a threat? <laughs> How you guys doing? What were you playing? <laughs> oh, Nova! That dork. No, he's great. I like him. He's cool. How you guys doing? What were you playing? I unfortunately don't really have like a shout out thingy built in yet. I haven't worked on that. Uh, shout out, Sister Mortis. Bam. There we go. I did a thingy. Hey, they're like, I'm in the aww. Are you, are you an actual angel? Or is that just like a ploy? Siege. Oh, Rainbow Six? Rainbow Six Siege? Were you playing with Nova as well, or...? Absolutely sweetest angel. Oh, okay. I'll believe it. We were just finishing up uh, some arena missions. We just killed our rank A guy, so we only got three more whenever we can unlock them. So we're, we're pretty top tier, if you want to... If I have to admit myself. So did you did you get some uh, some wins in siege? Did you carry the team? Sweetest angel. Aww. You can play solo in siege. I thought it was always like a what is it a five first five game or were you just playing by yourself? I've only seen like a couple of people play Siege. Like I think I've watched like Paladin Amber play Siege for a bit. Um, there's some other VTubers I think I watched for a little bit that did play it, but I I've never played Siege myself. Oh, okay, what would you like play as? Did you do you like do the the I don't know the, do they have like DPS rolls and everything in that game? Because I know like some people have like more shields or a riot shield kind of thing or more explosives or like. Rates or something. 
Ooh, six and two, nice. I've not been much for competitive shooters. Like, I, I did play, like, Overwatch and such for, like, a bit, like, way back in the day when Overwatch wasn't a trash fire. But, uh, I wasn't a real, I was never, like, competitive. Like, maybe if you, like, count Quake 3 Arena, I was competitive back then. Um, that would, in my way younger years. Uh, but, like, modern shooters I haven't really done much with. I played some Apex, but not a ton. I don't know if you really count Naraka as much of like one of these kind of games. There's not like a lot of aiming in it besides like using bows and stuff. But I've been doing a lot of Naraka as well with um, Daijobu. Entry fraggers. Uh, uh, trap entry denial. Oh, yeah. Do either of those use like the AC, uh, the RC cars to like run around and explode people up on their toes? I always found that hilarious when they use like explodey AC cars. I uh, play quick play. <laughs> but we were gonna do this one more mission and then probably call the night as well. But I do heavily appreciate everybody coming back in. You play, uh, have you played Armored Core? Any of you? As Do you like giant robots? In no one's getting any deeper inside. Which brings me to the job. The job. The laser is powered by a massive reactor. I want you to destroy it from the inside. Played five. Once the barrier's down, we'll step into the unknown. Where the coral's waiting for us. Coral is space oil. Oh, there's our boy that we're currently rocking with. Walter, it's like he already knows where the coral convergence is. What makes him so confident? We have the giant has desk in. Oh my, from like the Steel Battalion game? That thing was massive. It was like an Xbox 360 game, I think. There's people that have actually like, um, I've seen like mods for people like using that for this game. Great, let's start by finding our way in. Oh, you're gonna get this, nice. In that case, I need to then give you a follow so that I know to come check you out when you start playing. Hey, I just followed. I, I love AC. Um, I love giant mechs. I like doing gunpla and whatnot as well. Watch your footing. You don't want to fall into those lasers. Oh, I see them. High level threat detected. Threat level eight. Excuse me? Defense Woo! Base 4.0. Terminating target. This area is defended by snipers. Don't let them shoot you down. High level threat. It's a step up from intruder. I don't know. That hurts. No sign of the corporations. Looks like we're the first ones here. That hurts a little bit. Toasting my buns. Soul streamer. I, I'm sorry, I'm trying to like read, <laughs> read and uh, play a little bit. Oh, 
do I miss? Kick him. There we go. Soul streamer, so I was gonna play this before. Oh yeah. If you like souls, um, this is definitely a much faster paced souls game at this point. I know, I'm stuck. It's, um, I wouldn't really call it a Souls game. It's still an Armored Core game. Ar Ar armored Core, but Armored Core game. Yo, we got more over here. Ooh, a log. Oh, we can talk for a second. <laughs> Um, I started streaming before or after I finished Elden Ring, so I'm actually kind of looking forward to like the Elden Ring um, expansion so that I can like pop, bump, bring out the character and uh, stream more Elden Ring again. Done my best not to watch any completely go, you know, fair. Um, to also be fair, uh, I don't even know what's going on in Armored Core, so you're okay. <laughs> Um, I'd say missions are pretty fine, okay to watch. Uh, don't watch boss fights though, because the boss fights are always like the thing that you want to like experience and not know anything about. Uh, no averting the ruin that awaits both the Institute and Rubicon itself. I must now concern myself with that. What with what follows? Did it show sign of wave mutation? Observation must continue. Assistant number two is our only remaining hope. Though it pains me, I have no choice but to pass the legacy of our sins on to her, my own student. Uh-oh. Naga Nagai's vlog? Hmm. <laughs> About six more times on stream. Yeah, right. I'm really kind of tempted to do um, the co-op mod, but I have it on PS4, or I have Elden Ring on PS5. But I'll probably end up buying the PC one because I, I had no idea there was going to be a PC, um, the mod for uh, continuous co-op. So it's like, oh god, now I have to buy that. So I'll probably get to that too. One repair kit oh no! Is that all of those? How much more could there be? Ooh. Try to install the calm and it bricked. Ooh, like on the on the PS5? I didn't know you could like mod it on the PS5 like that. Or did it like brick your system or your your card? It's actually the first time I've ever heard anybody say like get a brick them. That's weird. Oh, another uh, core piece. Nice. PC gamer. Nice. Wow. That is unfortunate. I'm sorry. That that is the legit first time I've ever heard of that breaking someone's system though. I'm not seeing much else, but I see these areas that we haven't gone and explore. Hello. Woo. Tiny dudes ganging up on me. Let's check over here.
Only eight hundred dollars for those. Ain't worth it. I just play souls, so yeah. I feel you. It's one of those games though where it's like I would love to like carry some of my other friends through it. Cause I know I know like so many friends that are like bad at Souls games, but would love to play them. And it's like I would love to be able to carry them through it a little more lightly, I guess, just to get them to play it more. I do want to tell them just to get good, but you know, people only listen to get good so much. What's this? I see something sparkling. Mm hmm, enforcement system. Enforcement system has been buried deep within the Rubicon all this time. Little wonder what the suppression fleet was so quick to arrive. I tell myself to get good. That's what I've been doing this entire game. Oh yeah, these, these games are definitely about patience. Uh, I could bust out like the uh, the quick video of the get good with the Final Fantasy 14 music if you really want me to. <laughs> Ooh, do do for now. We shall monitor the observa observe 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 observers actions. Sometimes I can't talk. League match. Ooh, good luck. Right hand ammunition at 50%. Ooh, thanks for the follow. Hope to see you next time. I'm trying not to die suddenly. Give me one second. There we go, I didn't die. Oh, there's the entrance. A league match. Ooh. League of Legends, I assume. Yeah, have a good night. Appreciate you coming in. Raiden staying around. Anybody of your peoples that are hanging around still? Um, we'll probably raid out as well when we get done here. But yeah, I'll be sure to drop by next time too. I'll uh, I'll come by next time I can see you. Because uh, what tomorrow's Monday. I don't stream Mondays typically. Uh, so if I see you around, I'll definitely swing by. Nothing over here? Nothing. But yeah, take care. Enjoy your league. Don't get too uh don't get too salty with league, please. Nothing over here. I almost feel like we could just like fit through those laser cracks, but I don't think we can. Progress a schmidgen. Find the pressure chamber 621. Air pressure. Destroy it, and the resulting overload will cause the reactor core to explode. Ooh. Hydrate. Give me uno momento. I'm in the middle of a dying thing. Where you at? God, I love this laser whip. Okay. Hi, Dave. Thank you. Anything else? 
else over here? No. Nope. Oh, hello. Got them both with the whip. Defense weapon destroyed. <laughs> the pressure chamber is behind that partition. No repair kits remaining. What do we got down here? Ooh. Moshi moshi. Over this one. There, six to one. Destroy the target. Pressure chamber destroyed. Nailed it. Get out of there before it explodes, six to one. Oh. I wish you said that before. He's hurting. Six two one. There's no time. Get rid of it. What is this guy doing? He's like shooting um, moon gleam at me. Oh, he's gonna get me. This thing is beefy. Yeah, but I'm out of health. Fight back. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Working on it. And it's a timed fight, too. That's gonna be the tricky. Do I have to blow the reactor and then come back right in? That's what I did. There, 621. Destroy the target. So there's no other way out. Pressure chamber destroyed. Get out of there before it explodes, 621. Alright. The partition! Where'd you go? There you go. Please hurry, please hurry, please hurry. That's all right. Could have been bigger. That was a close one. Look, the laser barrier's weakening. The coral's near. Ooh. 
That's another solid milestone in our work. Was it close? I mean, like a minute. <laughs> oh, that's where we're ending. Okay. There's that chest piece that we picked up. Pretty neat. Ooh, are we going to get anything from the log hunt? We got some mind betas. Oh, those are reverse joint legs from the mindset. Let's check those out real quick. I I am a reverse joint sim. We know this. How was the trip underground, Walter? The enforcement system silent at least. Tried to take 621 with it. Good thing it failed. Well, that deals with the PCA then. What about the corpse? Archibus told us to wait before entering Terra Incognita. So you're close then. The corpse won't be helping each other over the finish line. Yeah. Archibus wants Balaam out of the picture first. Looks like Archibus is gonna win the race no matter what. Short term, maybe. But I think 621's going to be the key in the end. And that's why I shouldn't be the one to choose which jobs we take. Sounds risky. Our friends must be getting antsy. Maybe. But I think 621's got friends to worry about, too. Hey, don't talk about my friends. The voices in my head are very nice. They tell me to explode things. That is not just a crazy joke. Raven? That is her. You've got a request Talking from the head. Liberation Front to go with the order from Archibus. It was sent by Nettle Flatwell. He's the de facto leader of the Liberation Front, and he wants to meet you. Thank you, voice and head. One new message. Moshi Moshi. Registration number RB23. Call sign Raven. All mine? Your records have been oh. updated. We get arenas? S rank virtual encounters Yay. are now available in the arena. You will now face the best of the best. We wish you luck on the difficult road to mastery. It's gonna be nothing but me versus me then. This is the best of the best. Get it, get, get it. New mercenary data. Add it. No one. Data, uh, Sam Bowie. Let's check out those legs real quick. There they are. There's those boys. Alternate reverse joint developed by all mind. Woo! Jump distance is really high. What's it in comparison to the others? That's pretty normal compared to the others. So what's what's the the beef on this one then comparison wise this has got a better load limit but is not as heavy as the other it looks like yeah that seems to be like the biggest difference on this one um distance is still pretty good um it's just got a better load limit than these ones pretty much is the trade-off okay. oh we also got like a chest piece there it is. Ooh. Ian supply efficiency. That's that's skyrocket. It almost doubles. Faster Ian recovery. That's pretty spicy. I mean, that, that's almost a double recovery speed on that chest. Um, what's the downside? I, I lose kinetic defense. I lose a good chunk of stability, so if I get hit a couple of times, I will stagger quicker. But I gain some AP. My boost speed's fine. Um, I don't really lose quick boost consumption too much. A little higher, not bad. Ian recharge delay. Lower the value the more quickly Ian recovers after consuming after after consuming it. Interesting. That goes up a little bit. 
not, uh, <coughs> oh, excuse me, 5%. Five percent. Might be tempting to get, though. Like, looking at all the other chests that I have, everything is still in the 3000s. This is the highest in the 4000 for the recovery. But this one skyrockets. It looks a little dorky, though. It looks like I, my mech actually has boobs now. Not that boobs are dorky. That's kind of weird. Now I don't know what I'm saying. But you, you all know what I'm talking about. Add some jiggle mechanics to this thing. Um, do we want to change heads back again? reason we went to this one was scan distance again. Um, this one's still pretty good on the distance. <laughs> Aerodynamic. I guess. Do, do, do. We didn't really pick up any other new ones. And they didn't say anything new was in the part shop. So we're okay. I still... I'm just like super tempted to start buying these things. Like, th this just seems like amazing to like have. What are all these symbols? Inflicts kinetic. Oh, it tells you like all the types of things it does. So this is, uh, this is explosive. There's, there's coral weapons. Wait, what? We haven't seen any coral weapons. Oh god, we we have we haven't even seen like half the game. I bet at this point. Um, these icons are like so super small. I'm squinting to see it. Um, one round is fired with each trigger pulled. Single shot. This doesn't have anything. Uh, additional camera disruption. Shock. AC failure and it fills with the AC greatly reducing stability. Oh. Like, do we buy it? Like, imagine two of them. <laughs> I'm gonna buy them both, and we will eventually make a build that will have them both. Um, let's try an S rank before we go to bed. Let's go up on a high note or low one, depending if we lose horribly. Arena Combat Aptitude Evaluation Program Number Three: Only the best remain. Subject AC: Aster Crown. Call sign: King. Guy's beefy. He's got a lot of stun equipment. Commencing evaluation. And he's gonna be floating. Main system activating combat mode. He's just out of range. Ah, I saw him holding that charge. Jesus. Gotta make it work for it. Come and get me, buddy. I, I don't know. Did I win? <laughs> I got him. <laughs> The disrespect. Woo. 500 HP.
Yeah, he was pretty much a stun and then he will hurt you a lot. Like his one laser gun that he launched at me the moment I got stunned, he was holding that charge. These damn uh, AIs know what they're doing with this game. Then again, FromSoft has been like really good with like creating AI combatants lately. Arena Combat Aptitude Evaluation Program. Like, Number two, rank S. Everything they did with Dark Souls 2 and beyond, with three and then Subject Elden AC. Ring NPCs, it was all for this. Call sign, gun one, mission. It was all for making these mechs ridiculous. Commencing evaluation. Main system, activating combat mode. Woo! Calm down, buddy. another stunner. AP at 30%. <laughs> I got him again. I love doing that too. It's gonna be me. Liger Tail. I just I, didn't, I wasn't even paying attention when they said his name. It's a Liger. Oh, arena. Best of the best. We got Freud. Locksmith. I would laugh if it's just like a copy of my get my mech. That would be pretty funny. Final arena combat aptitude evaluation program. This will be the last evaluation. He's got the horizontal blade. Subject AC. Locksmith. Call He's got the big B1. bazooka on the shoulder that we just bought. Commencing evaluation. He's built pretty much like how I build my guys though. Best of the best, huh? Oh wait, my mocking is going to like come back at me. Thank you for your cooperation. No, he's getting up. Really? Is it is it really just gonna end it right there? At that dramatically? Ooh. I was like expecting him to like get like a second wind and just like get back up and like, no, it's go time. Okay, fine. Uh, laser drone. Hello, what's this? <laughs> well, I mean, he stayed down. It's fine. He did his best. Incoming cars. Check out that laser drone in a second. Congratulations. You have completed all ranks. Though these encounters may be simulated, you have reached the apex of our roster. We would be grateful were you to aid us in our research and development. All Mind exists for all mercenaries. <laughs> I 
um, actually, uh, since you actually use the TTS monster, that reminds me. Uh, we, I just set that up yesterday. Um, if you scroll down, uh, there's a TTS banner uh, that'll like give you like a an I or how to use like all of the TTS uh, voices that are enabled. So you can get like Bart Simpson to like say shit. You can get. Um, I don't pay the monthly fee, so I don't have the Morrowind guy that everyone loves to use in like every stream ever. Uh, but I did go ahead and get that set up. So if you know how to use TTS Monster, um, I got like a bunch of them. You can like you can have Trump talking, you can have Biden talking, uh, all the fun, stupid, goofy people in the world. Evaluation complete. So those bits, it, it's bits, it's just bits. I love it. That's pretty cool. Uh, Cause there's actually, um, I bought the smaller version of those, these ones. They just kind of like hover around and shoot. They, they have like a big EN uh, amount though, but the other one is going to be fun to work with. So that's curious. There's the cannons we just bought. Ooh, I'm excited because that we got one. And it can charge. When it launched, uh, these drones surround the enemy machine and provide supporting laser fire. The drones also pursue enemies allowing the user to effectively outnumber their target. If it's launching six at a time and it's only got 120, it's got a lot less shots than you think. It's got a high guidance too, Jesus. It is a charge. Charge attack power, charge, wow. Like, are you looking at that number? Like, here's just the normal attack power with by six drones, and then you charge it? Jesus Christ. <laughs> That's a big charge difference. Uh, definitely something I'm gonna have to look into next time. Or maybe we can just put one on right now. It fits. I got no reason not to. We can put the other bit on too. Can I fit the bazooka? <gasps> Wanna do a quick test? Just a smidge test. Enemy settings, give us a trainer on go. I'm actually really surprised the bazooka didn't do as much as I thought it would. Oh, hello. He's stunned to shoot the bazooka. Oh, he still gets out of it. That was a good shot on him.
I get you. I get you. So that does make it. Uh, I don't. I don't like the bazooka as much, although it's got really good stunning impact and everything. Like, this is actually a really fun weapon. It shoots it to the side. And just leaves like a trail of explosions. The charge of those is actually really fast. Oh, interesting. The bits are very interesting, is all I want to say. <laughs> can we fit both of those on there? Really quick. Actually, we can somehow. This thing is lightweight enough that we can fit both bazookas. Jesus, I did not expect that. It covers a lot of range. Coming for you. <laughs> All right, that's fun. But I really do like my twin rockets right now. These are really fun to use. All right. All right, we should probably call it a night. Unfortunately, there's work tomorrow. Lost connection, uh-oh. Yeah, there was a notice that they were going to shut down the servers briefly tonight. Alright. Right, it's bedtime, everybody. Who's doing what? Is anybody up right now? Only the big name people are up right now that I got followed. Bummer. Hope work is gone. I do too. There, there's a weird thing going on where they're uh, out of the warehouses I deal with. There's there's customer orders that they pick up themselves, and then there's the orders that we pick up. Want someone to raid? Uh, I mean, if you got uh, someone in mind, uh, the only people I got are big names pretty much right now, and I, I don't feel comfortable with rating big names. It feels weird. <laughs> Elegance is playing via Valorant. Uh, all 
Alright, let's go give him a gander. Hello there. Oh god. Oh no, we're being raided. <laughs> we were just ending. Hello, people. Oh dear. Hello, Lunara. How was everybody? We were just actually about to end ourselves. Um, I normally go for a bit longer, but... Yeah, it's one of those nights where it's a Sunday night and you got actual work tomorrow. How you doing, Lunara? Nice to see you guys. We were actually just about to end. <laughs> um, Artsy Faye just gave us a person to raid. We're going to go jump into Elegance VT. Um, he's playing Valorant right now, it looks like. Oh, yeah, stream went pretty well. We did pretty good. Um, got pretty far in uh, uh, Armored Core here. Uh, we knocked off all of the A and S rank arenas. Got one. We killed one boss and got some progress to the next boss. Oh, we got chips we could spend. Uh, we'll do it later. But um, I think I'm nearing the end of my first game run through. And then I got New Game Plus to do, and then New Game Plus Plus. So this game will probably go for a minute still. <laughs> but yeah, thanks for coming in, everybody. You just got the Juggernaut? So now you gotta double it and pass it on, right? Uh, the Juggernaut, what do you mean the Juggernaut? Was it... Do, do, do. This thingy? The mining ship? That was the last one you did. Uh, uh, the other one. Um, other juggernaut. Like, I don't want to spoil like too many names for you. Um, was it the, the guy in the orb thingy with all the missiles? The wall. Oh, okay. Wall climber, that one. Oh, the one at the very end. I get you. Yeah, the one you can't shoot at the front and he like charges at you, throws the mines everywhere. And you got your pal Rusty with you for the first half. Rusty comes back a lot later. Like, Rusty is still in the game with me right now. Rusty's my boy. I love Rusty. And then he leaves. You know, he's got to do a job, too. We can't, we can't blame Rusty for doing his job. Rusty's the best boy. He comes back later, don't worry. You get a... Uh, it's, a, it's a bit later down the road, but there's a 2v2 that you get to play with him. Uh, he, like, he joins your team and you get to just mop the floor with two other a against two other ACs. It is, it's a sick fight. I don't want to spoil it, though. That's all I'm going to say. Rusty's great. I love Rusty. But unfortunately, uh, again, I, I appreciate you guys writing in. Uh, unfortunately, I normally go for like five, six hour streams typically. Uh, but being a Sunday night, I got to go bed and do the bed thing and go to the work thing. Oh, we got hardy modes too. Loving the crowd. Alrighty, guys. I will go ahead and raid into who Artsy Faye told us to. We'll start it up. Um, Elegance VT. I've, I've actually never seen them. So, uh, this is at recommendation of uh, Artsy Faye. And we're going to hang out there for a minute and just kind of see what's up, I suppose. Yay! Um, I don't really have like a closing or anything. Just thanks again for everybody coming out, coming right now, all the fun stuff that you do. Uh, we'll probably get more Armored Core or 
I really want to get back to Baldur's Gate again, though, too. Uh, so it's going to be either more Armored Core or Baldur's Gate on Tuesday, one of the two. I have not decided which. We'll find out. But yeah. Um, I, I don't know what else to say. I don't really have, like, a closing. <laughs> Hope you have a good night. You know, that's a good closing. That's a good idea. I hope everyone has a great night. Take care. Um, if you work a normal salary job like I do, um, I'm sorry. But also, I hope your week goes well. And I hope you eat some delicious food or something. Have a good night, everybody. Bye.